Hello everyone, welcome in Cool IT Help. Guys, in this video tutorial, I will tell you how to enable compile on save option in NetBeans IDE. So, as you can see on the left hand side, there is a project and do a right click and you will see the properties. And when you go here under the build, this is the compiling option. So you can see on right hand side, there is a compile on save option which is disabled. In this tutorial, we will learn how to enable this thing. So guys, before proceeding, I have a request. So if you think this video is useful, so please like this video and share with your friends as well. And if you want such more useful tutorial on my channel, so please subscribe my channel and press this notification bell icon to get the latest videos updates. Okay, let's get started now. Now, so first what we have to do, we have to do a right click on this project and go to the properties and you have to copy the path of the project folder okay once you do it now come back on the windows explorer and uh, paste the path at this place and you will see the project folder and the file so here we have to search now project dot properties file okay once you find out this thing do a right click and open this file with a notepad and notepad plus plus so here we have to search one line so you can see here at line number 19 compile dot on dot save dot unsupported dot javafx is equal to true so we have to set the value false at this place once you're done save this properties file and close it now come back in the netbeans id and we will restart the netbeans id to up changes okay now we will okay now we will again check the same project and uh, by clicking the properties okay now going to the compiling section so you can see here the compiling on save option is enabled now okay so uh, in next step we will check this is working or not so this is my sample project I have created so I will do a minor change at this place alert dot set header text so i am updating the text value okay now i'm going to this file here we have a start method so we can launch this file so i'm running this project okay we will see the changes okay so here's the button let me click it you can see this is the header text this is 1123 that I have changed in my file. So this is reflect. So this is reflecting. That means compile on save option is working properly. So I hope you guys found this video useful. So please like, share with your friends and please subscribe my channel and keep watching Cool IT Help.